Tonight in San Francisco, Sean Connery, Nicolas Cage, and Ed Harris join filmmakers and invited guests for one of the most unusual events in Hollywood history. It's definitely nuts. I'm having a good time. I'm looking forward to seeing the film. The former federal penitentiary on Alcatraz Island was rocking as never before with a spectacular world premiere for Hollywood Pictures' new action-packed adventure, The Rock. Welcome to The Rock. The first time we saw the film, we knew that it was something very, very special. And since so much of the film takes place right here on Alcatraz, we thought, what a better place to do the world premiere. Logistical challenges began a week ago when an enormous floating crane delivered all of the necessary building materials to the island. Everything that we actually developed for the premiere, we actually barged in, craned off, and then used another 80-foot crane to drop it into the exercise yard where the film's going to be premiered. A state-of-the-art 35-millimeter projection system was also brought in, specially designed to be portable. We can put it on a bus, we can put it on a train, we can planes and automobiles. It can go anywhere you want to go. Alcatraz is operated by the National Park Service, which takes care to preserve the historic site and its indigenous wildlife. Part of any uh, important historic site is keeping its history alive and in this film and this event is an opportunity for again the uh, world community to be reintroduced to Alcatraz. Fire. Audiences everywhere will get a chance to experience The Rock when it opens this Friday June 7th. The Rock stars Sean Connery, Nicolas Cage and Ed Harris.